guest lecturer has made us to understand the importance of uh, zakat and the relevance of uh, Ramadan itself uh, connotes a lot of things that has to do our daily uh, uh, daily life. But um, what is most essential there is for us to continue to live according to the tenets of Islam, uh, be of good character, so that all our supplications to Almighty Allah uh, can uh, be accepted and make our wishes uh, come to fruition. My advice to all Nigerians uh, is to continue to persevere, uh, continue to pray for uh, Mr. President Ashwa Jibala Ahmed Tunubu because the man uh, means well and for a situation that has been so uh, badly dealt with for you to get it corrected requires a lot of perseverance uh, a lot of patience and i know too well i showed you being a dogged human being a man that is full of energy full of character obviously at the end of the tunnel there shall be light uh, what we are experiencing in Nigeria today uh, is not peculiar to us alone. It's a global uh, downtown. It's a global issue that people in London, people in the US, even Ghana, our neighboring country, are growing uh, upon. And when you look at the wars, the fights, uh, Russia, Ukraine war, and all other uh, splinter. Uh, uh, clashes and crises here and there. You agree with me that it's 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 a time, it's a period for all of us to seek solace in the Almighty Allah, so that um, things can be uh, better off. At least in the last two weeks, you agree with me that the the nature at which uh, dollar has been jumping is now snowballing. Unfortunately, Nigerians will not say anything about it. The prices of goods and services will not still come down. So I know over time, when the system is fully uh, stabilized, I'm sure government will go after uh, uh, the markets to get uh, market stability uh, for price control. The special grace of God, all I pray for is um, good health, longevity of life, uh, for one to be able to uh, continue and complete uh, all that our heart desires. Uh, nobody finishes government job. You only do your best and leave the rest. Uh, what is essential to me and my team is to leave an indelible mark whereby if tomorrow comes, you can beat your chest to point to project A, B, C. If the Lord tarries, you point to projects as far as A to Z. And not just um, putting up projects, I mean meaningful projects that have meaning uh, to human uh, existence as well as the community uh, that we live in. Um, and at the end of the day, I want to be remembered for uh, capital projects that have direct impact on the lives of our people because we are actually representing our people. So, at the end of the day, you agree with me that we have to face projects that has to do with education, projects that has to do with infrastructure, projects that has to do with environment, um, health, as well as uh, social development, which is the agri department, where uh, you have to, you know, take care of the women, the youths, you know, as well as our community critical stakeholders. Uh, that's why, as far as I'm concerned, I don't regard what we do now as palliative because as far as this administration is concerned, we have been doing palliative even before the economy hardship starts. And we came up with the support for the elderly uh, because we discovered that when uh, the age that we're talking about, 70 and above, obviously at 70, 
you should be retired. And if you are retired, of course, uh, by the grace of God, you must have options. Have uh, children, have great-grandchildren, have um, grandchildren. Uh, we are not asking our elderly to rely on uh, uh, their options alone. As a government that is responsible to the people, uh, we feel uh, this elderly too should have something. Yeah, it might not be something uh, that, that big, but even if it, it is common parastamol or common uh, 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 um, daily supplements that they, they could use the money to, to buy. At least it will go a long way uh, to address uh, their little uh, economic challenge that will affect them taking um, care of themselves. You ag equally agree with me that even before uh, the hardship that everybody is talking about, we have been doing food for all that we take, com take to community uh, by community. So as far as I'm concerned, uh, whatever anybody is doing now is something this government has projected as seen the future that is, is going to happen. So we are not caught, we are never, um, we are not caught unaware of the situation at hand.